My name is Tim Faulkner and I'm proud to be a part of the anti-venom program we run at the Australian Reptile Park. We milk funnel web venom to supply CSL in Melbourne so they can make the life-saving anti-venom. Funnel web spider bites were usually fatal, but there have been no recorded deaths since the development of anti-venom 30 years ago. The Sydney funnel web is the deadliest and usually found under rocks in cool, dark, damp places or in your shoes. I'm going to show you how to safely catch a funnel web in your home or garden, but never put yourself at risk. Please don't touch them, don't try and pick them up. First, grab yourself a glass jar that's at least 10 centimetres tall. Punch up some holes in the lid so they can breathe a little, and then you need to add a bit of substrate. You can put in some damp soil or some damp cotton wool, and that's just fine. Don't use a plastic container like a takeaway container because funnel web fangs can pierce right through them. The funnel web is an aggressive spider, but they don't jump. So you can place your jar gently down behind the spider using a stick or a ruler, at least, let's say 30 centimeters long, and gently put the spider into the jar. Once he's in, lift him up and the lid on. And remember, don't leave it anywhere near the kids or in sunlight. If you live close to the reptile park, you can drop the spider off to us. If not, we have drop off points as far south as Wollongong, north to Newcastle, and a lot of places in between. Visit the reptile park's website, reptilepark.com.au for drop off point details. And thank you for helping us save lives.